Whether you've lived in Charlotte for a few months or many years, you've probably been to Amelie's because it is a Charlotte staple. But today, some employees took a stand against the beloved cafe. They accused Amelie's of discriminating against employees. I believe that they are racist. Outside of Amelie's Noda location Saturday, former employees shared stories of working for the company. They said the discrimination they faced was persistent through all of Amelie's locations in Charlotte and Atlanta. I instead watched people I trained get promoted to MOD while I was constantly given a reason why I couldn't be promoted. I wanted to be here today to absolutely validate what they are saying and to share in the labor of holding Amelie's accountable. Employees shared how the discrimination they encountered impacted them financially and emotionally. It was sad to me that the place I had once loved so much had treated me so poorly and created an environment so toxic to everyone that wasn't white. On top of the discrimination claims, they also said Amelie's made false claims about financially supporting groups that fight racism. The protesters demanded that Amelie's change their practices, pay their employees more, and donate 10% of their profits to the community groups they claim to support. I still have hope for that Amelie's can be better, and I hope they hear our stories and they make real changes within their environment. And we did get a response from Amelie's CEO today. He said many of the claims against them happened six years ago under different owners and management. But he also said, quote, we have a lot of work to do. We've let too many things go unchecked and unaddressed, and we will no longer be complicit and complacent.